day two yet. And that's the St Pancras Hotel. It's part of St Pancras Station. Say the date. It's the 10th of January 2018. It's about 8 o'clock in the morning. Well done. Anyway, this is the entrance to the Bull Street Station. This is my planning suite at the moment. This is focus. For the flooring officiados, real wood down there, Mr. Manning, and a touch of carpet here. Anyway, this is Centurion by Hadrian Borders Brewing, 4.5% alcohol by volume. <coughs> Traditional, maybe a hint of spice. Really lemony. bitter. I hesitate to say, but a kind of cooking. B plus. This is good. This is the Mac Break Weekly whilst reading the Telegraph on the Kindle. This is not from London. This is game one by JW Lees. 4.2% alcohol by volume. My next plan is to go to Mother Kelly's in Spitalfield Market. <laughs> About five minutes away, hoping to the Hopefully. Mm. That's rather malty. Slightly sweet. B plus. The last one here before I move on. This is Gantz number three. From the Ramsgate Brewery, 5% alcohol by volume. Just had the fire alarm and the evacuation thing. Coded messages. I know for ages. Great fun. Mr. Manning. <laughs> if it was Monday, it would be multi Monday. That's really multi. Looks like a finish, B plus. Find Mother Kelly's, and all I have to do is find the toilets. Faulty. Mother Kelly's, and it's a bit like the Italian place from, ooh, well over a year ago. However, there is heat above me. And I am drinking Oos Melim from Estonia. 4.7% uh, alcohol by volume. That's American IPA. I think it's in San Diego, who knows? Look at all the bottles. Anyway, the aromas around here are lovely. Ooh, really nice, really hoppy. A little sharp on the tongue, he says, as he spills it. That's a B. Wow. I've never heard of these before. Boxcar Brewery there from London. This is a Morello Cherry Goes. Uh, it says around here somewhere 5.6% alcohol by volume. Landed drinkware. Excellent. Yeah, I can get cherries. Um, you've literally gone first time to well, it's not sweet. And it's slightly sour. A little tart. B plus and a bit. I don't know what to make of that one. Not bad though. Flooring Mr. Manning. Industrial. 
very industrial. Anyway, a Belgian sour. 20. Like from the UK, vibrant forest, 3.5% alcohol by volume. The Zua gooseberry. Sharp and fruity, and that's just the aroma. Oh, that's nice. Very sharp in the finish. Refreshing. This will be better on a hot summer's day. However, the heating from above seems to be working quite well. B plus in a bit. Yeah, B plus in a bit is fine. A little bit more would be better. Okay, London Brews. Last time I was up here, it was full of Gaza's beers from Funtrissant. Funtrissant is in London. Crap beer. Okay, music so take down. Uh, no wedding party here this time. And this is oh, look at that flooring, Mr. Manning. It's real. This is Christmas is cancelled. Tempest brewing, 4.5% alcohol by volume. I'm getting it early. I'm cancelling it. They also have pantalon goods on draft. It's hellishly expensive. I wonder if they have a quarter. Okay, it's a Thornbridge glass, but we don't care. Oh, there's Hobson. Oh, that's not bad. Gently hoppy, slightly sweet, touch of malt, B plus in a bit. Pale Ale, 4.5% by Atom. That's pump clip. There. Okay. It's in the Thornbridge glass, by the way. I think it's multi day, I don't know what it is. Apart from January. B plus in a bit. I still like the flooring. I kind of have a hat. Oh gosh, I am drinking. Yeah. Kind of have a. Soft spot for Parkinson. I think they've moved now since I was there 2016 November. This is their pale ale, 4.5% alcohol by volume. It is mosaic in here and it already smells wonderful. Oh wow. Sharp, citrusy. Yeah, really sharp, poppy. D plus plus. Absolutely. 